Hi, and welcome to our instructional video that is designed to make you a smarter gambler. My name is Steve Borey, and I'm the author of the American Casino Guide, which is the number one best-selling book in the U.S. on the subject of casino gambling and travel, and the only book that comes with more than $1,000 in casino coupons. If you want to know more about the book, be sure to visit our website at AmericanCasinoGuide.com. And if you have an iPhone or iPad, be sure to download our free app. Just go to the App Store and search for American Casino Guide. In this video, Michael Shackelford, who is also known as the Wizard of Odds and the author of Gambling 102, explains all about Mississippi Stud. He tells you how the game is played, the various bets you can make, the casino advantage on those bets, and the best strategy for playing the game. And now, here's Michael Shackelford. Let's talk about Mississippi Stud. This is another popular poker-based game. Unlike some other games I've talked about, this is a game where the player wins based only on his own cards. There's no dealer hand. The game starts out where the player makes an anti-wager. Then the dealer's going to give the player two cards and three community cards face down. When, after the player sees his first two cards, he may either make a raise bet of one to three times his ante bet, or he may fold. After this decision has been made, the dealer is going to turn over the first of the three community cards. Again, the player can either raise one to three times his ante bet, or he can fold. Then the dealer is going to turn over the second community card. Yet again, the player can raise one to three times his ante bet, or he may fold. Finally, the dealer is going to turn over the fifth community card and pay the player according to the poker value of his hand, according to a posted pay table on the table. That's all there is to it. There's um, no side bets to the game. And the strategy is not too complicated. Next, let's talk about the strategy for Mississippi Stud. There is a different strategy for all three decision points. And I'm only going to talk about the first decision point, because the second two are a little bit too long and technical to explain in this video. After the player sees his first two cards and before any community cards are turned over, the player should make the big raise three times as anti-bet with any pair. The player should make the small raise equal to his anti-wager if the player has any high card, where a high card is defined as a jack or higher. The player should make the small raise one equal to his anti-bet if the player has two medium cards, a medium card being defined as a 6 through a 10. The player should finally make the small raise equal to his ante bet if he has a 6-5 suited. If the player doesn't have any of those things, then he should fold. The good thing about Mississippi Stud is the player has three chances to raise with good cards. The bad thing about it is the player is forced to making a raise or fold decision. There is no checking. So sometimes if the player has a bad hand but not a terrible hand, he's mathematically speaking, he's making bad raise bets because it's at least better than folding. So oftentimes the player gets kind of sucked into the game with mediocre hands and then ends up losing. The experience in this game is you have a lot of losses that are offset by the occasional big win. Mathematically speaking, assuming optimal strategy, the house advantage in Mississippi Stud is 4.91% of the original ante wager. That means that for every dollar the player bets on the ante, he can expect to lose 4.91 cents. For the um, strategy for the second and the third decision points, I highly recommend my website, wizardofodds.com. It's got the full strategy for the game. If you want to know more about me or hundreds of different casino games, it's all on my website, wizardofodds.com. And my book, Gambling 102, has strategies for the most popular casino games. Don't forget that you can see more of our educational gambling videos on our YouTube channel. Just go to youtube.com slash American Casino Guide. 